It is story time. It is story time. Come on in. Ready? It is story time. It is story time. It is story time. Come on in and let's explore. There are so many open doors. Come on in and bring a friend. Come on in and let's begin. It is story time. Welcome to story time with author Michelle. Well, make sure you bring your book buddy. I have a new book buddy that's been joining me for story time. It's one of my characters from my book, Shelly Goes to School. Who do you think it is? Yep, it's Shelly. Everyone say, hi, Shelly. Shelly, say hi. Shelly's very shy. She'll join us each time for a little bit until she becomes comfortable and she can come out with us all the time and hang out and talk to us. So, thank you so much. Shelly, yeah, sit right there, sweetie. All right, get your book, buddy. Bring your stuffed animals, snuggle up. And once upon a story time, there was a book titled Night Night Valentine. So if you're getting ready for nap time or bedtime, what a beautiful story. Night Night Valentine. This story is written by Amy Parker, illustrated by Virginia Allen. So let's open up this book door and let's explore. When we stop to celebrate the many things we love, we look around and see that they are all gifts from above. Grab some paper and some string. We'll draw and cut and tie a string of hearts from me to you to spread love far and wide. Night, night, hearts. Daffodils push through the snow. They smile and wave and say, thank you to those who love us so in oh so many ways. Night, night, flowers. We'll write notes to all our friends and all of our family to tell them just how much they're loved, how much they mean to me. Night, night, friends. I'll make a card for Grandma, some art for Grandpa, too. Then seal it with a great big kiss to tell them I love you. Night, night, grandparents. We'll make treats to share the love, and I'll help decorate. I hope that Mommy doesn't see how many that I ate. <laughs> night, night, cookies. Do you bake Valentine cookies the night before Valentine's? I think I'm going to bake some over the weekend with Zion. Gift of love are all around if we'll just stop to look. God promises fill up the sky just as they fill his book. Night, night, God. Look at that beautiful rainbow. Even mommies need a break from everything they do. I run a big old bubbly bath to tell her I love you. Night, night, mommy. Aw, don't forget to tell mommy you love her. I'll give dad extra snuggles to show how much I care. To thank him for all that he does for always being there. Night, night, dad. The cards and gifts and flowers are all a sweet surprise, but the best gift is one big hug before I close my eyes. Night, night, Valentine. The end. 
How cute is that story? Well, if you would like to bring Night Night Valentine home to your house, why don't you visit your local library? Or if you want it to become part of your Valentine library, why don't you visit your local bookstore? Or you can also tell mom and dad, you can order from places like Amazon, Barnes & Noble, or Target as well. So go and visit your library. It's so much fun and having fun isn't hard. Remember what author says when you got a library card. All right, so if you're getting ready for bedtime, night night sleep tight. If you're getting ready for nap time, have a nice rest. If you're just enjoying Valentine's stories, come on back to Once Upon a Story Time with me, author Michelle. I have more Valentine's stories for you. Well, this story time is all done. Thank you, everyone. See you soon. Come back.